Okay, let's record some video. Let's go into custom games here. Uh, what do we want to do? Let's play some back to basics. I've wanted a standard issue rifle game for ages because I've seen them on PC and they look fun because you don't die as many times as you would in a normal match. Apparently there's a hundred plus results. So let's sh let's see this. Show me the money. Look at this, we're on a server. And there's no one here. Hello everybody and welcome to the Little Game. My name is Dewey101 and today we're going to be talking about some custom games. I'm doing a bit of a talking series now. Um, we're going to be talking about what the hell happened. So, custom games are servers that are made on by the Battlefield community of the DICE employees. As you can see, Hardcore, now I know the Hardcores will be full, but at the moment I'll just be talking about Fog of War and Back to Basics and all of these game modes. I don't know if Friday Night Battlefield played DICE, but the custom games are just horrible. As you guys saw at the beginning of the video, I tried to join a Conquest Back to Basics, which is standard issue rifles only, so it's only bolt actions. Um, nothing happened. Why? Well, I'll tell you why. To make a custom game, you have to go create a custom game, and then you have to buy one. I'm not actually going to buy one, but as you can see, you can change your name, the message, the maps and modes, the weapons, and all that stuff, but no one's doing it. As you guys saw in Battlefield 4, however, everyone was buying servers. So you just go through, you can change all your friendly fire on, off, hard off, always fog on, vehicle spawn, name tag, everything you is at your disposal. But you can't make private servers and you can't kick people from servers, which is probably what's happening. No one's playing them because you don't have enough power over them. Um, so custom games, look, let's go into the browser. Uh, server browser. Let's see how many custom games we find. We'll go on to the most played. So far nothing. Nothing. Oh look at that, we got Japan only in Australia and we got a CSA server and we got a not... Oh no, there we go, we got four. Other than that. Oh wait, no, we got five. Five fully empty servers. Um, and that's the exact problem. No one's doing them. Again, this is only on Australia, but still. Oh no, there we go. We've got some more. There's a couple. They're just not. Um, they're just horrible. Because no one's playing them. It just shows the difference between Battlefield 4 and Battlefield 1. Is people are fine with the normal game. That they don't want to play anything else, which I think is damaging it in quite a way. Like, you look, quick match. You got, you got, you got nothing that can change the. I agree with this. Okay, I want a standard issue only rifle server. Look at this weapons. Let's turn off everything but standard issues. Okay. On, off, 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 off. Look at this, view servers. There's none of them. There's no standard issue servers. Let's let's expand the search out of Oceania. Okay. Cause that could be damaging it. View servers. There's nothing. No one's doing servers now. It's horrible. Look, enjoy custom experiences highlighting what is popular in the community right now. There's nothing popular. That's what I didn't get. I mean, we'll try playing with some dice. Let's see if we actually do encounter a dice member. Don't know how that works, but it's not even Friday. It's Monday. <laughs> so, but yeah, I'm, I feel kind of a bit let down by dice. Because you go into Battlefield 4 right now and you'll find some of the only servers that are active are custom-made servers. 
which means the dice are obviously doing something different on this game that players just don't find a need to make their own servers which I'm finding a bit disappointing here you go, we're on some giant shadow here but yeah, this video could become a lot more depressing than what I anticipated but still dice please, I wanted to host a Digzilla gaming server on this so you guys could join but just the fact that no one joins custom servers, there's one custom server active and that's a one from Battlefield 4 that I played on T9 Strange Music Server. He did one on Battlefield 4 which I loved and he's done one here that people are playing occasionally in Australia but it just, there's no point in making it. I mean when you've got operations and you've got all the maps, you don't really need much, like I'd love to have a standard issue rifle server. I know that Jack Frags is hosting two of them on PC and everyone's asked him to do some for console. Look at this. You play with dice, there's no one here. There's one guy who's playing as an assault right now. And that's it. Wait, let's go. Look at this. This is just, there's nothing here. It's just an empty wasteland with an occasional French vehicle. But look at this. It's just barren. There's nothing here. At all. Play with dice and there's one out of ten on each team. Like, dice need to do something about custom games fast. They're dying. And if DICE don't do something, then all custom games are never going to be played. Actually, just before we end the video, let's go check if there's any hardcore servers. Because I know people like playing hardcore, but if it's a hardcore server, it'll only be on Conquest. Because no one plays hardcore in the other games. <sighs> hey. Something needs to be done. Let's go into Hardcore Rush. Not rush, I didn't mean to go rush. Let's not go hardcore rush, let's go hardcore conquest. And let's see what comes up. Another thing that they need to fix, battle packs and medals. Medals I just have active just so I get extra XP, that's all I do. I don't really care about the dog tag or whatever the hell I get. I really don't, couldn't give two shits. What I want to reckon they should do with the medals is you can have like a total of three medals you can select them not on this there's like a separate option where you select them and they'll be displayed on your soldier's chest or something which would be cool because it actually have a bit of good element to it oh right. we found another server um but just this game it didn't have that it doesn't have that satisfaction that Battlefield 1 had. I mean, Battlefield 4 had. Battlefield 4, you could play it, sit down, it was fun, it was, in a way, an arcade kind of game for me. You just sit there, you have some fun. In this game, you just sit down and you get obliterated by Model 10 A Hunters. Not to say that Battlefield 4 had perfect balancing, but still. I mean, why? Anyway. Hopefully we can have some people in the server. And I'll also, I'll show you what I talk about when I say hardcore. This is a bit of a rant. Look at this. There's no one here. No one. There's not a single person on the hardcore servers either. So dice. Do something or your servers are going to die. That's it for this video. And guys, please go send messages to Dice. Just tell them to address this issue. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye.